Hi guys, welcome to Ice Talk. Today I am gonna talk about a mammal, but it lives in the water forever. But it goes up for air. It is also known as a sea cow because they eat grass in water. And they have a grayish color. They are the reason that we think mermaids are real. And they are endangered because people will hunt them. Today we have the harmless, the gray. The dugong! The dugong is a medium-sized marine mammal. It is one of four living species of the order Sirenia. It also includes three species of manatees. It is the only living representative once diverse family the gong die. The dugong is a species of sea cow found throughout the warm latitudes of the Indian and Western Pacific Ocean. It is the closest relative stellar sea cow was hunted to extinction in the 18th century. The dugong is the only Serenian in its range, which spans of the water of some 40 countries and territories throughout the Indo-West Pacific. The dugong is largely depend on the seagrass communities for subsistence and it is restricted to coastal habitats which support seagrass meadows. With the largest dugong concentration typically occurring in wide shallow protected areas such as Bay Mangrove Channel, the water in shore islands and in the refer waters. Like modern Sirenians, the dugong has a fusiform body with no dorsal fins or head limbs. The fore limbs or flippers are patterned like. The dugong is easily distinguished from the manatees by its rugged, dolphin-like tail, but also possess a unique skull and teeth. Its snout is sharply downturned, an adoption for feeding benthic seagrass communities. The molar teeth are simple and peg like Unlike the more elaborate molar dentition of man, the dugong has been hunted for a thousand years for its oil and meat. Traditional hunting still has great cultural significance. Several countries in its modern range, mostly in northern Australia and the Pacific Islands, the dugong current distribution is fragmented and many populations are believed to be close to extinction. The IUCN lists the dugong as a species vulnerable to extinction. The lifespan of the dugong is 70 years or more. The dugong reaches sexual maturity between the age of 8 and 18, older than most other mammals. 
The age when a female gives the first birth is disputed, with some studies placing the age between 10 and 17 years, while others place it as early as 6 years. After 13 to 15 month gestation period, the female gives birth to a baby dugong. Birth occurs in very shallow waters. As soon as the young is born, the mother pushes it to the surface to take a breath. Two bonds are already 1.2 meters long and weight around 30 kilograms. There's a 5,000 years old wall painting of dugong, apparently drawn by Neolithic people. In Tabun Cave, Malaysia, it was discovered by Lieutenant R. L. Rowling in 1959 while on a routine patrol. Dugong, along with other Siberian, are referred as sea cow because their diet consists mainly of sea grass. When eating, they ingest the whole plant, including the roots. When evidence exists, they will eat allergy when sea grass is cursed. Although almost completely herbivores, they will occasionally eat invertebrates such as jellyfish, sea squirts, and shellfish. The scientific name of the dugong is dugong dugong. So friends, this is what I learned about dugong. If you want to know about any special animal, let me know. If you want to know about the other animals I did, please comment me. Your support is my energy. If you still not subscribe my channel, please subscribe and press the bell icon so when I make new videos, you can get the notification. If you like my video, please give me a thumbs up and share to your friends so we can learn together. Save wild, save future. Love animals. This is Aisha signing off. See you next time. Bye!